Fix news is out of Taiwan. Hundreds of same-sex couples marry in Taiwan on first day. It's legal. Amber Wang and Kristen Huang are two 24-year-olds from Tapai. Uh, they joined 526 other same-sex couples in registering for their marriages on Friday, the first day. It was allowed under law that passed last week. That is um, the first kind anywhere in Asia. And... Sorry... That went on forever. I feel very proud of Taiwan because we are the first country in Asia to legalize gay marriage. Huang said legislators passed the law despite divided public opinion after more than two years back and forth involving the constitutional court and voter referendum. So, yeah, I mean, finally, finally, people in Asia, in at least Taiwan, are allowed to get married to each other. And so 526, 526 couples showed up to get married on the very first day it became legal. That's awesome. Yeah, that's great. But why Taiwan took so long? Like, I understand. So, and the, the people there are still divided on this? What, what's, the, what's the source of this division? Like, are they, is Ty, Taiwan is not very religious, I assume. Is it? Actually, let me see. Uh... So, I want to know why. Taiwan, let's see. Taiwan religion. So we do have a different. We could. It's good to see that, and it's not good to see, but it's important for us to see um, other sources of nonsense like homophobia, and because you know other other reasons why people might be conservative, other than right. Abrahamic well, religions. But I want to see before we make any comments. I want to see. Okay, Taiwan here. So it's 35% Buddhist, that's number one, 33% ta Taoists, then the number three is 18% non-religious, and then by a huge margin, number four is 4% 4 Christian. Is Buddhism against gay marriage? So this might be, I don't know if it is or not. I but think this is more cultural than cultural. religion because right. we had, there were a ton of same-sex marriage opponents uh, that spoke out saying letting same-sex couples marry deprives children of their mother-father household and will lead to insurance benefit scams. Mm. Um, and so that's where they kind of focus their stuff on. And so, yeah, in 2018, 72% of people in Taiwan said that marriage should be restricted to one man and one woman. And I think that, again, this is more, this is more just this is how things have always been let's not change it's just cultural rather than religious right so it's important for us to see this because there's a lot of atheist activists that think all the world's problems come from religion right and i always want to okay, point which is, not the case. which is not the case i want to point out that the world would be a better place without religion but not all the problems of the world is going to be solved with that religion. And there, people take this idea to two different extremes. They're like, oh, there will still be war and violence and greed and all that with that religion. So what's the point? Like, yeah, there will still be war and homophobia and racism, but there will be less of it. Okay? It will still be there. It will be less of it. But a lot of atheist activists also, the other extreme is that atheist activists, I think, are, every problem in the world could be somehow tied to religion. No. We still have, like, look, Taiwan, which is a not very religious country, and even the religions that they have is, I don't think it's that much, is that very homophobic. Still, I, it took them this long to uh, accept gay marriage, and even now they're still very divided about it, right? So right. homophobia exists in other forms as well, not just Abrahamic religions, but that doesn't mean it's, you know, that Abrahamic religions don't increase or encourage that. They do increase and encourage that. But again, both extremes do not make sense. And, so, and, and again, I'm not all, just because I'm saying both extremes, both sides are wrong. Like the people think that without religion, the world would be just as shitty. No, they're wrong. The world would be better. And the people that say, think that the, without religion, the world would, become, would be utopia, they're wrong as well. So the, the answer here is probably in the middle. But that doesn't mean that I think that the answer is always in the middle. That's a, fal that's a logical fallacy for you to think that if there's this argument and this argument, the answer is some always somewhere in the middle. No, sometimes one side is completely right and the other side is completely wrong. I'm just saying in this scenario, the answer is somewhere in the middle. Um, let me see. Morgan is saying so happy to see this. But I, I have a question. Like, how many people? 500? 
Five hundred and twenty-six couples on the okay. very first day. So this this break this is good because it also destroys another stereotype that gay people are supposed to be good at planning stuff, because this is horrible planning, right? <laughs> like this is not the day that you do your marriage when five hundred other people are planning their marriage. Like you know how hard it is to get flowers and get a venue and everything well, on the you, same day. Group. This is a group, Sarah. So like they all gathered together. They were in this together. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. All right. So, well, uh, okay. Then it breaks a different stereotype that gay people want everything to be extravagant. You know, you know, ha -ha. like yeah. So to Thank be, you. is yeah. So to because they're like, look, they're doing it simple. They were like, just like something small. All of us together. It was, unity. It was about unity. It was about all unity rather than making scary. it making everything fabulous or all that, right? So it breaks that stereotype, right? Um. Let me see what other the top comment is. More, um, this Mitra is saying this makes me so happy. Is there one? There should be one comment here saying when did the atheist republic turn into, um, you know, the gay republic or something like that. There should be someone, somebody saying that. something. I love. You always call us gay atheist republic, which gay secretly I love. <laughs> gay atheist republic. Yeah. So, uh, sometimes when you post stuff about, you know. Um, LGBT rights or homophobia people are like I didn't realize this is the gaseous republic I'm out of here Ray is saying <laughs> Ray is saying good for them but marriage isn't all it's cracked up to be uh, Gazi is saying humanity one organized religion zero I don't Gazi I don't know if this has anything to do with religion uh, Ron is saying did they did they tie their knots and he's spelling tie with as T A I, um, a different lover. Okay, should we? Oh wait, Jack is saying something. Jack is saying there is a cultural difference. There, there's cultural differences when it comes to countries like Taiwan, uh, Taiwan, South Korea, Japan, China, etc. Lots of ignorance around progressive issues, and they just don't know anything about it. Yep, just to show that ignorance comes in non-religious forms as well. Atheists are under attack in many places. If they were Christians, their voices would be heard. If they were Jews, their voices would be heard. If they were Muslims, their voices would be heard. But they are atheists, and not many seem to be listening. Let's make it difficult for them to ignore us. We have built a global community, and now we are tearing down geographic, cultural, and language barriers so we can find each other and support each other. In the last decade, we have built the largest atheist community in the world. Now we are doing the same in other languages. With your help, we have started Atheist Republic in Persian and Arabic. انضميت مؤخرا لأسرة Atheist Republic وحيصير عندي بودكاست باللغة العربية As we grow, we can dedicate more time, staff and resources to start doing the same in Spanish, Portuguese, Malay, Bengali, Urdu, Hindi and other languages. We are providing community, support, informative content and amplifying the voices of those who need protection, especially in countries where people feel isolated simply for their lack of belief. We want to be there for them and we are only getting started. Help us get there. Check in the description for ways you can support our projects.